something bad happened. Ah! Ah! Won't you help the mummy kid? Won't you help the mummy kid? Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today we're going to make an apple pie. My favorite is peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? Good job! We can use a sharp knife. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Look, I'm a pirate! <laughs> That doesn't seem safe. Okay, Willie, let's cut the apple. That was hard. We have almost everything we need to make our pie. We just need some sugar. Hmm, do you know where we keep the sugar? Is it in the pantry, the refrigerator, or the sink? Great, let's make a pie. Hmm, can you smell the apples and cinnamon? Okay, it's time to bake a pie. First, preheat the oven to 425... I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent to help. I'm not sure where they are right now. <laughs> We're on our own, Willie. First, preheat the oven to 425 degrees. Then, put the apples into the pie tin. Now, put it in the oven and bake it for 40 minutes. Our pie is ready! I can't wait to eat it! Willie, let's have some pie!
Where's the birthday girl? Usually my mom holds my treat money. Well, come on, Lauren. We have a special surprise for you. Okay. Here's what I have. <laughs> Who's ready for ice cream and cake? She's busy with her best friend. Is that show on 24-7? It's like she didn't even hear me. And we need to talk about some new TV rules. <laughs> you know what? Hold on. Let me try. I, I wanna I wanna capture the big surprise on video. <laughs> Lauren, honey! We got cake and ice cream, we got your favorite, mint chocolate chip. Come on, baby, we can watch Amanda another time. It's so much fun Lauren? to buy your own Everything okay? Lauren? Mm, Lauren? I love mint chocolate chip. There. I'm Amanda. And I'm Lily. Uh, Amanda, maybe some of our friends can come back to the neighborhood? That's great! I like that there are so many friends in my neighborhood. Today, I want to send something special to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? I don't need to go there right now. Do you think this is funny? Just take me to the store. Now, can you tell me where I need to go? Good job. Let's go to the store. Let's pick out a card. My pet. Something bad happened. What kind of card should I send them? That's not the right card. I don't think we want this. I think Amanda is confused. <laughs> hmm. Shh, here's a secret. It's my birthday. Maybe we can help her out. Are you sure that's right? I don't... It looks like it. I bet your friend is really going to love this card. My friend is... My friend... 
My friend is having a birthday! I want to get my friend a special treat! Where can I buy a treat for my friend? Oh, I know! Let's get them some nice candy! Do you know where the candy store is? They don't have anything we need. Look at the stores! Which one sells candy? Uh, does this help? Great! What, why did you do that? Now I can't find the candy store! I don't know where to go! Can you help me? Don't do that! I don't want to go there! I said I don't want to go in there! No! Why is this happening? No! Why can't I stop it? This isn't the candy store. There is nothing here that I want. Maybe you can take us someplace else? I want to get my friend a special treat. I want to get my friend a special treat! Let me out of here! Oh, Amanda. That's... That's a nice birthday card. Do you want to give it to your friend now? Will you address the card? Who should I send this to? Oh, Willie. It's your birthday! I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Ba. Wooly just made an animal sound. He said ba because he is a sheep. Can you make a sound like a sheep? That's great. You sound just like Wooly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. You sound just like me. At a petting zoo. There are lots of animals here to pet and play with. It's fun to spend time with animals. They are very different from people. They look different, and they don't talk like people. Amanda, I'm an animal, and I... Animals don't talk, silly. Look at these signs. Let's make sounds like the animals on the signs. Are you ready? A goat says, meh. Meh. A chicken says, 
A pig says, blink. <laughs> fun! Animals make funny sounds. Do you have a family? Animals have families too. Let's go see one of the animal family. I want to see the chickens. Can you show me where the chickens are? That's not where they are. Don't you know what a chicken looks like? I want to go look at the chickens. Great! Let's go see those silly chickens. What a cute fib. Having a family is nice. I see a mommy chicken and baby chickens. And I see... I see a daddy chicken. Look at the chickens. Do you know what the daddy is called? No, that's not what they're called. Try... Do I have to help you with everything? The daddy is called a rooster. The mommy is a hen and the babies are chicks. Some mommies eat their babies. Yum, yum. Okay, let's go see some more animal families. Where should we go next? I think it's time to visit the sheep. <laughs> Can you tell me where we can find the sheep? Ew! I don't want to see those. They're scary. I don't want to go near... that. <laughs> the sheep are waiting for us. Where are they? Okay, let's go! Look at the nice sheep family. All the sheep are right where they belong. <laughs> Hi, little kitten. Where is your family? It looks like this kitten is all by herself. How do you think she feels? She must be so scared. There's nobody to love her. This kitten is alone. There is no one to help her. Will you help the lonely kitten? Will you please help the lonely kitten? Won't you 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 help the lonely kitten? like me. called 
try again. Again, I'm Amanda, and I'm Wooly. What's that smell? What do you think is making that bad smell? opposite of alive is? Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? I don't think we should be talking about this. Are you afraid to think about it? Dead is the opposite of alive. Good job! <laughs> when an animal dies, it rots too. It looks like this kitten is in big trouble. It might die before anyone can help it. Should we help the kitten? We really don't have much time.
Amanda! And I'm Wooly! What do you like best about... Your neighborhood! I like that there are so many friends in my neighborhood. Today, I want to send something special to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? <laughs> That's not the store, silly. Good job! Let's go to the store. Let's pick out a card. My friend helped me when I was sad. What kind of card should I send them? I don't want to play anymore right now.
Trust me. Lily! Ready for an adventure? Amanda! You know you can't. Lily had an accident! When a friend has an accident, sometimes nobody can help them. But we can try! No, Amanda! I I'm fine! I, I, I just, uh. Poor Lily is so confused! We really have to help him. First, we have to know what is wrong. What part of Wooly is broken? Isn't Wooly acting strange? What could be wrong? Wooly's head is broken, but Dr. Amanda is here to help. Let's prepare the patient. Here, Wooly, drink this. Uh, I don't know, Amanda. It's all just pretend, isn't it, Wooly? Amanda. Uh... We need to operate immediately on the patient's brain. What tool should we use to fix Wooly's head? The saw, the hammer, or the forceps? That might be helpful, but what else could we use? Things could get really messy if we use that. That looks hard to use, but I could try. <laughs> I tricked you! We're going to use all three! <laughs> the patient is getting rowdy! I'll need a little help here. Help me! Please! So, who are you going to help? Let's get the patient subdued so we can finish the operation! Everything will be okay. I'm Wool. Hi. Trap door. Treat. I'm... I'm allergic to apples. How many chair? How many mushrooms? How many fruit? How many 
plate. We don't have much time. Four oh one two five eight. We don't have much time. <laughs> Hi, I'm Amanda. When you're friends, you can share all kinds of things with each other. I can share my crayons with you, so you can have fun coloring too. Look at silly Mr. Fox. Sharing shows you care about someone. Friends can share toys. They can share snacks. I'll share some of my snacks with you. Which snack would you like? Yum, that's my favorite. Friends can share other things too. They can share secrets. Can I share a secret with you? Are you sure? It's a big secret. Is it really okay to share my secret with you? I'm out there. Somewhere. <laughs> 